Hello YouTubers, it's Champion DJK coming at you yet again with another video and today I am ultra excited to bring to you um, a unboxing of 2017 release one set C and set D for Auto World. Uh, both of these sets are limited to 1256 of uh, each car. Um, so multiplying that by two and then uh, multiplying that by 0.03, it's about 75 ultra reds per casting. You love that high tech editing here? So, yeah, we're going to do an unboxing video of this. I ordered this directly from AutoWorldStore.com. This is the box that the uh, sets came in. We'll first just unbox this. Um, once we get to the actual unboxing of the inners in here, um, I'll flip the camera around so we can actually take detailed looks at the cars. But I just wanted to do this broader thing for pulling this out. Here's how it's packed. You get a catalog. I'm pretty sure they put this in every order. Um, I do already have one. Um, and then they throw some Johnny Lightning Vault cars in here. And we'll take another close look at these too. So first off, we got this um, Mustang in red. That's pretty sweet. We'll take a closer look at that. Um, they send you, here's an AMT air freshener. Pretty sweet. Um, and we got some cards, I guess, that were never used. Some vintage Johnny Lightning cards. Let's take a look at those. And then a Speed Racer from the Playing Mantis Vault. Speed Racer 2000. Eh. Kind of cool. So there's those. And what else do we got here? It appears to be a poster of some sort. Definitely a poster. 45 new castings for 2012. Johnny Lightning. I don't know how we're going to look at this together. It's huge. <laughs> but it is pretty cool. It's got the, the Boogie Vans series. That's a cool series. And I have some of those vans. So there's that. Um, can't really take too much of a close look at that. And then we got our two inner cases. Um, I believe this is set A. Or set, sorry, set C. And this one is set D. All right, so let's flip the camera around. Let's break into these and uh, hope I score big. Okay, real quick, before we get in these cases, here's a close look at the extra stuff. Here is uh, that Mustang. This is actually an old one. This is from uh, 95, probably. Well, I don't know. It's copyright date of 94. Um, here's the back of the card there. There's how it explains the number on it, which, I don't know, it's interesting. It says 95 fair. I don't know what that means, but uh, looks pretty cool. The paint job's pretty neat. Um, so there's that, and then we got the Speed Racer car, which I'm not greatly excited about, but pretty neat nonetheless. This is from 2000. Quick uh, peek at the back of the card. There that is. Here's that air freshener. And here are these other two cards, which we don't really need to take too close a look at, but this was all extra stuff for ordering those uh, sets. You get one. Um, extra little Johnny Lightning Vault car for each set you order on AutoWorldStore.com. So <clears throat> here's that. Here is set C, and uh, let's cut this sucker open. Um, this is exciting. Um, I hope I hope I score an ultra red. That would be super cool. So I'm just gonna pull them out here one at a time without really peeking. And first up, we got the. 1970 Chevy Impala looks very nice in white. There's your limited one of 1256. Very cool. Definitely not an ultra red. And next up, we got this is my favorite one in the series, of course, the 1969 Pontiac Firebird in this awesome looking black, gloss black. Very, very cool. I'll be looking out for another one of these to have loose for sure. There's those. All right, so next up we got 
a lot of people's favorite, the uh, 1964 Ford Country Squire, and this is in skylight blue. Looks pretty nice. All right, and three more to go for this set. Oh, this one looks really awesome. This is the uh, 71 Dodge Challenger RT in bright red with a uh, flat black roof. Very, very cool. Awesome. And next up, we got two more here. The Dodge Polara Max Wedge 426. This is a pretty cool one. Uh, this is an aqua color. Pretty neat. So there's that one. Last chance for an ultra red in this case. Is it going to be one? No, it is not. But it is the 1964 Pontiac Grand Prix in a silver mist gray poly. Yes, I looked at the paint names <clears throat> on AutoWorldStore.com so I could provide those to you and not struggle with naming uh, these colors. So, there you go. There are your six cars for um, release, or set C of 2017 release one. So now let's get this box out of the way very quickly and move on to the next. Here we got set D. Case pack of six cars. We'll go ahead and cut this one open and see if we get lucky. All right. Again, pull them out. I'm going to pull them out in a certain order. I'm just going to grab from the case and take a look. So the first one we get is the Ford Country Squire, and here is its alternate color in uh, Chantilly Beige Poly which is kind of like a silverish color with a little hint of, I guess, gold to it. That's why these uh, colors are like impossible to describe. Um, so pretty cool. You notice the color changes down here, but still limited 1256. But I like how they put on here that you're, it's obvious what set they're from, which wasn't always the case on their cards. So that's pretty cool. So there's that one. And moving on, we got the Chevy Impala. The last one we saw was in white. Um, what do they call this one? This is a green mist poly with a flat black roof. What was the other one? Gloss white. Yeah. So, looks very, very nice. And next up we got the Dodge Challenger RT, the 71, this one's in a gloss black, and it looks really, really nice in this color. This is a real standout release of this casting, I think, the color combos they went with, the black and red, and the reverse of it, pretty awesome. So there's those three, three more to go. All right, and the 69 Pontiac Firebird Trans Am, beautiful car. Uh, this is Warwick Blue Poly. Looks very, very nice. And next up, we get the uh, Pontiac Grand Prix. And this one in pictures and probably on camera here may look to be black. Um, it is actually a Nocturne Blue Poly. So it's a really deep, dark blue. almost uh, Not really purple at all, but just a very, very deep, dark blue that looks nearly black. Not quite a navy blue, but there that one is. And last up, and no ultra red, oh well. But we got this 1963 Dodge Polara Max Wedge 426 in its alternate color in this gloss red. So pretty nice all together. As you know, Auto World is my favorite band, brand, and the best way to order them is probably just to go to autoworldstore.com. Um, you do get a legit chance at a chase. Um, obviously, I did not get one today, but as you know, they're pretty um, rare. If they're 3% of the production, that's pretty rare. And especially when the release is already limited like this, um, 
you know, it's going to be, they're going to be tough to find. So, pretty cool. Just go through all of them real quick one more time. There's that Dodge Challenger. That one looks really nice. And the other set. Pontiac Grand Prix. Mac Wedge. That blue. Dodge Challenger. Yeah, I really like these two. That's pretty cool. Of course, the Country Squire is a favorite. Black Firebird just looks freaking awesome. And the Impala. So, glad to add these to my collection. Thank you very much, AutoWorldStore.com. Go there and get some of these. Like I said, they're limited to twelve fifty six, so there's not that many of them out there, really. So... Pretty awesome. Thank you very much, you guys, for watching, and have a great day.